This is Code.org. I'm working on CS Discoveries, the physical computing unit, and I'm on the lesson Circuits and Physical Prototypes, Smart Bike Blinker Controls. With your turn signal LEDs hooked up, yes, you just need to program some buttons to control them. You may want to place buttons somewhere else on the bike to make, to make controlling your turn signals easier. But for now, we'll just use the built-in left and right buttons. Ah these ones. Cool. Add an event handler to turn the left turn signal when the left button is pressed. Oh, okay. Add an event handler to blink the right one when the right button is pressed. Test your code. Okay, so I am then going to be renaming these to this one is going to be my left and this one's going to be right. Okay, for the LEDs. So, oops. Now, when the buttons are pressed, we know how to do this. I'm going to go to circuit because we want to detect, right? So, on the board event and on the board event. So, on the board event of the left button being pressed what? Down. What do I want to happen? On the board event of the right button being pressed down, what do I want to happen? Well, I want an LED on. But what LED? Let's go over to maker here. Oh, I already declared them right, left, and right. So I can do, I can use it as a property where our, oops, circuit. So I want the, do I want it on or to blink? Blink. So how do we do blink? Blink. Going to drop that here, except we need to edit this. I'm getting rid of this stuff because we're going to use our variable. We don't want the onboard ones to blink. We want the stuff to, that we added to. So I'm going to make the left one blink eh, maybe at 200. And now when the right button is pressed down, what do I want? Well, when the right button is pressed down, I would want... The right button to blank it, I'm going to say 200. We'll try that. And right is because I named my light the right light, right? The variable is right. And so that's why it's, oop, not down though. Um, blink. And then this is how many milliseconds. So on the event of the right button being pressed, the light I have attached should blink at 200 milliseconds. Let's give this a shot. Blinking. Oh, but it's not going off. Oh, that's a problem. Let's use my other one. Our other one's having difficulties. I wonder though, is it because yellow? See, that all would stay still. Is it because one's already blinking? R button. Let's try adding an off. Yeah, we definitely want an off. So we're going to do this same thing. Onboard event, right? So I'm just going to do a copy, control C. I'm going to hit enter on a Mac. It's con command C and then control V to paste all that. Except this time when it is not down, did they have an up? I forget what they have. Yeah. So once it's let go, what do we want? Well, we would want the light to go off. And so that would just be for me, what is this? This is left. So left, and remember, I'm writing left because that's what I named the, the lights variable. Left, um, off, and then it was just parentheses to turn something off. Oop, not a colon, semicolon, not a colon. Uh, uh, right for the right button, dot off, but ah. Okay, let's see what this does. On the right, on the left. Yep, okay. So I had a few wiring issues. I'm going to skip over all that. I got it fixed, and so let's test out the code. Okay, got it figured out. My goodness. Um, this is actually going to be zero. This is actually going to be two. These wiring things are tricky. It was a little bit off of the light. So the code is all good here. I'm going to hit reset and run. This one's going to make... 
the the left will make the is that gonna be my left button? Yes. Um, and then, yeah, the left is going to make my left blink, and then if I hold down right, the right will make the right one blink. So, perfect. Alrighty, let's keep going. 